Welcome to the Greasy Gals. Today we're talking about plastic, all kinds of plastic, and where you should recycle it. So, I took a class, and from what I understand, the recycling machines cannot include these into the recycling process because there are these rolling machines and things like this and grocery bags will actually get stuck in the machine and the rollers and has to stop the process. So that is why when you go to your grocery store, you'll see plastic bag recycling bins, right? Usually at the entryway. And it's not just for recycling your grocery bags. You can take these. I mean, the ideal thing to do is to take your own reusable bags, but sometimes I forget. So I, unload my groceries and then I have a big bag that I save and then I just add all these things and about once a week I will go put them right back into that recycling bin at the grocery store and what kind of plastics can you put into that recycling bag uh, bin sorry um, not just shopping bags outer wraps I bought a two pack of turkey and it came wrapped in this kind of plastic I'm gonna show you what I do this can go into the plastic bin at the grocery store. When you peel, this can also go into that bin at the grocery store. I usually take the gross part that soaks up the meat juice and throw this into the trash and this can go in your regular recycling bin that the city takes. Don't take this to the store. The ones at the store are just for flimsy plastic. So what kind of other plastics can we put in there? You can put any kind of flimsy packaging once it's empty don't leave any food in there you don't have to clean it out but just don't put dump food in there any kind of bag that does not have foil lining if it has foil lining in it like this like a chip bag or cracker bag or anything that has foil on the inside because it's two different materials you cannot put that into the grocery store plastic recycling this has to go into the trash outer wraps for cases of drinks, shopping bags, just empty plastic bags, salad bags, uh, cheese wraps, frozen food bags, Ziploc bags, bread bags, and cereal bags, not the box. The cereal box goes in the recycling, but the inside bag can also go with the rest of these into the store recycling. So what do they do with all of this? Well, the store sends all of the plastics to another recycler who will take them and turn them into brand new bags for the store. They make composite lumber out of it or things like park benches that are made out of that plasticky material. It came out of, yep, old salad bag, which I think is pretty cool. Well, I think that's about it for today. Thanks for watching the Greasy Gals channel. Bye-bye.